I think what we're looking at is the NBA being ultra careful here. The Toronto Raptors had to postpone their last two consecutive games over COVID-19 concerns. The most recent of those games was supposed to happen tonight against the Detroit Pistons in Tampa Bay. But that game has been tentatively moved to Wednesday night. Yeah, I spoke to somebody this morning that said they are still investigating. They're still testing. They're still doing the contact tracing. So uh, that's why, um, as it came out, it is tentatively rescheduled for tomorrow. Until Sunday, the Raptors were one of just four teams in the NBA who didn't have to postpone any games because of the league's health and safety protocols related to COVID-19. But that all changed on Sunday when the game was canceled because the Raptors didn't have the league minimum eight players. Everything happened so fast during, you know, today. So we had to readjust uh, tasks, uh, time and schedule. So we had to uh, you know, go a little bit, a little bit on the fly. On Friday night, Raptors assistant coach Sergio Scarliolo had to step in as head coach against the Rockets because Nick Nurse and five of his coaching staff were placed in the league's health and safety protocols. According to Sportsnet's Michael Grange, one of the coaches tested positive for the virus either on Thursday or Friday. We haven't heard anything out of uh, the Rockets camp or any issues with the Rockets at present. So. Um, you, you know, you just kind of trust the NBA's judgment. Pascal Siakam was also held out of the game on Friday because of an inconclusive rapid test. The Raptors' postponement of their game is the 31st time this season that a game has been postponed in the NBA because of the league's health and safety protocols. 32 times if Wednesday's tentative game is called off too. And I don't think that becomes a firm yes or no until they do all the testing and, and find out uh, exactly who's sick, who isn't, uh, who's contagious, uh, you know, how many players the Raptors actually have. So I think they're waiting on all of that to, to make sure. The Raptors are scheduled to play Wednesday and Thursday of this week before the All-Star break. Now, if those games are postponed, they'll be added to the back half of the Raptors season, which starts on March 11th. Right now, the Raptors are scheduled to play 36 games in 66 days. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.